Hi, Brett Sakula here with Coach Blair. Coach Blair, what do you think about your team's performance tonight? Well, I was very pleased. I thought we really executed well. I mean, we really started the game executing well offensively, and I thought we did a really good job. Defensively, we were a little sluggish at first, but I thought that came around uh, after the first five minutes, and we did a lot better job of guarding them. And then I think, you know, the second half, we went on a big run, and I thought I thought we did a really good job. And, I, you know, I played nine players, and it's nice to get in nine-player rotation. What can you and your team take from this win and use it into going into the next game? I think the thing you've got to take is you've got to be focused. I think if you're not focused for 40 minutes, a team can come back. And we let them get on a little bit of run, and I thought we lost our focus. You know, Instead of going ahead and putting somebody away by 20 or 30, we let them right back in the game, and we fouled them, did some silly things. And, and we can't do that. You know, Going into the tournament, when you get into the tournament, you know, you're one and done, so you can't lose your focus. You've, you've got to be focused every game. And that's the one thing that I'm trying to emphasize to our team in practice is to get in there and have great practices for an hour and a half and don't lose our focus. Thank you. Hi, Brett Sakula here with Amber Gregg. With two minutes left, Coach Blair called the timeout. During that timeout, what did she tell you all as a team? She just told us to keep our composure, you know, stay calm. The game had intensified a little bit more than it was because they were trying to make a run. And she just told us to stay calm and keep our composure. You had a 15-point lead at halftime. Going into the second half, what did Coach tell you all to keep up y'all's intensity in the second half so you all did not lose that 15-point lead? Oh, you know, well, Southeastern is a very good team, so we knew that they were going to make a run eventually in the second half. So we just had to execute in the half court and keep our same game plan and stay with our principles. And the outcome was great. Tonight, as a senior, you reach your 1,000th career point. Reaching that milestone, how does that make you feel? I mean, it's good to be in the category with Monica Gibbs any, in anything. So it's good. I couldn't have done it without my teammates. So they're to thank, too. And I'm just happy to be here. UTSA defeats Southeastern Louisiana 71-58. For Roadrunner Sports Network, I'm Brett Sikula.